Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome to another vlog. That's right, RB Vlogs is back today. It's another vlog day. It's Tuesday. Um, and uh, and so today, oh, hey, bright sunshine, ow. Um, today, we want to talk a little bit about just a couple of things that have been going on in the old RB household the last few days. Um, so if you caught my uh, FTB Horizons episode on Sunday, you heard that... Uh, you heard that I had some unwelcome guests in my uh, in my humble abode. What is going on here with this car trying to cross these railroad tracks? They are definitely not moving in appropriate manner. Um, anyway, so you heard that I had some unwelcome guests in the pantry of my house. Um, we got we we got ants. Um, now we live in Georgia, uh, and so the summer months are are nice and warm, nice and hot for a long time. But in the fall, typically you get uh, you get animals and stuff that want to try and move into your house, just like any other uh, just like any other territory. But but because the summers are so long and so hot, they get a from what I can tell, they get a much longer I don't know breeding season or whatever. The ants that were in my house. They're just these little itty bitty ones. They're not, it's not fire ants or carpenter ants. They're just these little, I mean, I don't even know what you would call them, but uh, some, I've heard some people call them sugar ants. Um, there's other words that people call them that I can't say on my channel. Uh, but, but they were everywhere. Oh my gosh, they were everywhere. And so I went to the, I went to the store and I got some stuff because I like to try and do things on my own first. Um, that was a mistake. <laughs> I should not have done that. Um, uh, so I, I went out and I got some. I went out and got some bug spray, and uh, and I tried to treat it myself. Not a good plan. Um, they have come back with a vengeance. They are so mad at me right now. These ants are, um, and so we have uh, <laughs> we have sucked it up a little bit, and we have called an exterminator. <laughs> we have a we have an appointment tomorrow with a local exterminator. He's going to come out. And, uh, and get us taken care of, and hopefully this will, uh, this will do the job. But um, <sighs> exterminators aren't cheap, guys. Oh my gosh, exterminators are not cheap. Plus, because of the way that ant colony, and I, and I do get this, I understand. I understand that, that these places have a, businesses, that, a business that they're trying to run and, and they want repeat business, but, but ants, and well, bugs in particular, are unpredictable. Um, and so just because they're going to come out tomorrow and, and treat the house doesn't mean that they're going to go away. And so they're going to have to come back again and again and again and again. And, and they want to they do this over the course of a year. Now, the fortunate thing is, is that the, uh, the, the, the initial visit tomorrow is going to be about 160 bucks. Okay. And it is what it is. Um, but, um, but then they want... They want to come back every three months for a hundred dollars uh, every three months, and uh, and just make sure that that we're protected. Now, I think that that's money well spent. Uh, I'd rather not, but I think it's money well spent. But it's it's one of those unexpected things. So my so my so my my topic for today is what kind of you know. And of course, this is something that you're if you're not comfortable about talking about it, I understand. Um, but what kind of unexpected expenses have you guys been hit with lately? I've been hit with a bunch. I got the I got the ant problem. My youngest broke his glasses. He, um, I, I broke the windshield on our vehicle. I was trying, I was trying to clean the windshield one day. I had a bunch of dirt and dust on it. I was trying to clean the windshield one day, and the windshield wiper snapped off in my. Uh, snapped off in my hand and the wiper arm came smacking down back on the window and cracked it um, so so we've had some some very uh, in some cases some expensive unexpected expenses um, in the RB household lately and so you know if for, for those of you that are comfortable chatting about it down in the comment section down below leave your uh, leave your unexpected expenses that uh, that you know maybe have some humor value to them, and uh, and we'll chat about that. But uh, that's the topic for today, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The likes and subscriptions help out oh so immensely when it comes to those pesky YouTube search results. Other thing that helps out all those comments. So again, leave your comments down in the comment section below, and we'll chat about it. Um, also, don't forget to come on over to the Discord channel. The it's getting more and more popular all the time. Of course, keep your comments for the videos in the comment section on the video, but but we can chat about stuff on Discord too. Um, 
Uh, but the, the community there is growing. We get people in there all the time that are, uh, you know, new followers to the channel. And that's one thing I want to thank you guys so much for. Uh, we, we're, we're getting more and more subscribers, more and more viewers on the, on the channel all the time. But more importantly than that is we're really starting to get some regulars. We're getting some folks that, that kind of live and breathe for RB videos. And, and I really do appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much. For the uh, for the dedication and the support on my videos it means a lot to me it really does but uh, but anyway folks thanks for watching today and until next time we will catch you on the flip side we'll see you later bye bye